With the holiday season around the corner, a new market showcasing local Latinx talent took place in the city today. The goal was to not only exhibit what the Latin American community has to offer artistically, but to also show how important representation truly is. It's a first of its kind, a holiday market geared at showcasing Latin American artists in Toronto. One of the things that I wanted to do is represent uh, the Peruvian diaspora, but also the Afro-Peruvian diaspora. And so I have prints and cards and stickers. I'm an illustrator, but right now I have greeting cards, uh, art prints, stickers and fridge magnets. I think Toronto is such a diverse and, and amazing city, but sometimes like groups uh, get kind of like lost and, and separated and it's hard to find community. So having this representation shows the city like uh, Latinx people are here. The event called Mercadito, which translates into Little Market, had 30 different artists from painters to jewelers and live art demonstrations all from across Latin and Central America, many of which made items that reminded them of home. And just really kind of like trying to make sure that um, the Latinx diaspora feels a little part of home. Um, because a lot of us sometimes don't get to go home often. Uh, so, you know, when you get a little card that says, Toma tu caldito, you can hear your grandmother or your mother telling you to eat your soup when you're sick. Latin America is incredibly diverse and we come from all different places. But when you're far away from home, I think it's good to find that sense of community. The market was put on by Creato a new community-driven Toronto-based collective dedicated to connecting and supporting creatives of Latin American backgrounds in hopes of amplifying their voices and creating more representation in the local artistic space. We started like an online community um, and then now it has gone beyond to actually in-person events and we started to do a lot of um, community events and then this is the perfect an event to actually, you know, build community. It's so nice to be able to have a spot to be able to do this. Um, and yeah, to all come together. We have like a Peruvian table right here. We have a Peruvian chef and there's so many other amazing artists and we're all really just helping each other out in the community. Latina people are, you know, like something that people should invest in and they're super talented folks and, and we're here and we want to show the talent uh, that we have in the city because we're here and we want to be seen. More information on the collective can be found on their website, credo.com.